tell us in the comments. Don't forget to hit the like button and share this video with everyone you know. Remember, no? Around exactly the same time last year when we started actually our first uh, episode for HR Shouts and Whispers. Uh, this has been um, a very good idea coming from Christina. And uh, me and George got to like like the idea because we've been uh, actually giving value already doing our Facebook lives and streams online. So uh, as Christina wanted to focus on the HR communities per se, because um, personally, how I saw things is Christina was always in uh, the active groups eh? like um, Philippine HR group and other HR groups here answering questions from HR people. So as I got to see her being an expert answering different uh, questions, really hard questions, I because this this person has really the the logic and the know-how to actually help more people. So I was actually doing my own FB lives already. So I actually uh, stretched my hand, Chris. Uh, I'd, I'd be glad to help you with uh, putting up something for the HR communities. And then that's where HR uh, your first episode. Yeah. So, pero siya yung main host. Siya yung main host. I'm, I'm, right. I'm here just to support. Yeah, the name itself, you know, um, it, it's not a typical branding for, for uh, an HR consultancy. But I feel that there's something there. I know that it was probably the brand that you started as a podcast. But moving into hardball HR consultancy and, and, and maybe, you know, HR marketing, it's, it's, it, it's an interesting brand to, pers- to push. I told Christine tonight, I think I'm going to explore it further with you guys. And, and here we are. So and you- putting that together into something that's going to be fit for purpose for organizations is, you know, is something that we really want to evangelize. No? Kasi, uh, when they say kasi it's OD, people think na, hey, you know, you're just going to be there to teach people and give them skills. Actually, no, it's OD is, is quite different because we're going to give skills, but we're also going to help you understand your processes better. We're going to help you communicate better. We're going to help you change better. So it's it's really more of that. So it's something deeper. And then I think that's what what the whole, uh, that, that segment of HR Shops and Whispers is all about. Uh, crafting an organization that is that adapts because of the changes and, you know, um, when when companies merge and when you acquire, when you get acquired by another company, my goodness, there's a lot of re-engineering that has to, to happen, and that is a very complicated and possibly a complex, very complex process to undergo. And the the typical HR of before the old school coming to this century, uh, you really have evolved. Uh, into a, a, a very, uh, like it's, it, there is a science to it, and a lot of uh, experts have now emerged to help organizations to make this transition and to adapt to the changes. You will know if it's managed well, if the results come out well. There, there are like different people with different expertise that are willing to share their knowledge, their experience, and insights every week. It's very important to keep the customer at the center of your operations. If you don't, if you remove your focus, more so in a time of crisis, some way, somehow, your operations will definitely suffer. I think uh, for the new temporary, the, 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 the operative word that I'm looking at is to be able to lead, or for that matter, trailblaze, or in fact, lead, you know, everyone else, you know, lead everyone else a few more steps ahead of them, so that whatever happened before will no longer happen again. Remember, we were caught flat-footed. We were caught flat-footed. We, you know, we, we thought that, yeah, you know, this is just going to be really short, but no. Like, especially here in our country, it's been like almost a year already, we're still in the lockdown. And then there's so much uncertainty. So the thing there is, let's adapt faster. But this time, now that we're learning, let's lead it. You know? let's, let's be steps ahead of everyone so that we can, forever it's going to take us, it's going to be faster to arrive in that destination. Stay tuned for the next episode. Only here on Z81 Radio, Manila.